what Jordan does. There's what Jaden does. There's the offensive production you're, you're getting. When you look at tonight, like, is this the sort of game where you look at and say, okay, we are starting to find that rhythm offensively? Do you feel you've already been at that point? Or how do you look at tonight? Tonight was very similar to our last three or four games, to be honest with you. I mean, the puck fell in the back of the net a little bit more. And, you know, we wondered if it was going to, you know, at some point in time during the second period. Um, but, uh, you know, getting the first one, I thought, was uh, was a real important uh, piece for us. Uh, the Morgan Geeky goal, um, you know, just for our power play. You know, I mean, every every power play extends another four or five seconds actually at after run that you know it actually runs out so that was a that was a hell of a play and a good finish and then you know the next uh you know the big one was you know ebbs is at the end of uh at the end of the second there we've had a great period and all of a sudden we're down by one um it's tough to leave that period with nothing to show for it so it was you know it was nice for him to be able to get that one that was a big play between he and Schwartzy. Well, we've seen chemistry between those two really from the first day of camp. Um, we've had them split up at times. We've had them together at times. Um, you know, the previous two games, um, we've we've had them together uh, for, you know, for short periods of time. And as we got to the halfway point of the game today, we, we made that switch permanently for the rest of the game. And those two, they, they read off each other well. And Wayne did, a, you know, a good job with them as well. Well, there's a couple different looks, you know, with you know, with wanting to simplify a few things. You know, you put guys on their one-timer sides, um, you know, and, and you're looking to get the puck and then you know get the puck to the inside. And um, you know, Buffalo came a little harder on their kill tonight than maybe you know that uh, they they usually do. But um, you know, he was able to get off a couple good shots from that spot, um, and you know that that second one, you know, found its way in the back of the net. I think it went off the top of Tukarski's pad. Um, and uh, and in so um, it was nice to see it go directly in. But if it doesn't, you know that should give us an opportunity at a rebound. Is Geeky okay? By the way, he got hit pretty hard there. Yeah, I have nothing, nothing to my knowledge. What's your current comment on the uh, the penalty kill unit? How many offensive chances it created? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'd like him to bury one. <laughs> uh, no, that's you know it's a real balance, right? Uh, you know, I think we had, I think we had a. Uh, two breakaways and probably one, you know, one extra that was close to a two on zero. Oh. Um, you know, so obviously the guys are working hard to get those opportunities, um, and you know, along with that, you know, you still have to get back and, and get the rest of the kill as well. So uh, it's good to see. I mean, you know, we were aggressive, you know, especially with our forwards on the PK, um, and you know, those guys generated some opportunities out of it tonight. Well, you know, offensively, uh, we gained a little bit off of it. The, you know, the the Eberle goal at the end of the second period. Um, you know, the, the biggest factor in in forward checking tonight is um, is trying to take away some of their playmaking on the back end. And you know, it doesn't. It's not about big hits or um, you know necessarily. Uh, you know, putting the guy into the glass, it's really stopping the progress of their of their group on the back end. They're so good at evading, um, you know, getting the first pass and then jumping by and joining the rush that uh, if you let that happen too often, it, it happened a few times tonight, but if you had let it happen too often, they're, uh, they're dangerous. Dave, we talked a lot in the last week about getting chances and just needing a couple to go. After a night like this tonight when they do start going, is that something that, that can carry over into the next couple of games, that momentum, are people relaxed now? That well, I don't, you know, I don't, I don't believe that everything just happens automatically like that. Uh, um, you know, or have, have guys been a little tight and squeezing it? Probably. I, I don't know if guys will, will speak to that or really, you know, admit to that, but um, it was nice to see a couple go in. We haven't got a lot of bounces, even in the first half of this hockey game, there was a lot of pucks around, uh, you know, that, that, you know, went through the blue paint and out the other side. Um, so to me, there's a couple things. It's it's nice to have a little puck luck, you know, and we, we got that on our fourth goal um, on Ebbs is on the fourth one there. Um, also, uh, you know, just the hunger to get to those areas and, and really expect to be able to punch those home. That's still an area that can grow uh, for us and, and getting a few tonight helps that. You talked about guys gripping their stick, but it seemed like tonight there was a couple <clears throat> shots and especially goals 
where people were able to get power on their shots. I mean, is that something you've consistently seen with this group and you know, practice throughout the season, or is that maybe like a little bit of a new dimension that maybe there's more strength there on those chances than you thought? No, guys are. I mean, that's never. That's you know, when when I say gripping it, you know, guys sometimes overthink things. Um, I, I don't know that our guys really have been doing that. You know, we've generated a ton of opportunities over the past few games. Um, you go through stretches like that. I mean, the the puck didn't go on the net. We, you know, the other team give the other teams goaltenders credit. Um, credit the other teams defensively a little bit as well. Um, you know, the biggest thing is to continue creating those opportunities. We did that tonight, and and we got the job done. And that's the you know that's the most important thing, and that's a good feeling for the players. You good. Thanks, Dave. Great. Thank you.